Hello everybody, it's Joss Allen at the Winter Nam Show 2018. I'm here with the mighty, the illustrious Corey Belly of Trivium. Cool. How you doing, man? Good. Yeah, all good? So, obviously, I saw Corey. I was going to go up and get a photo anyway, because I'm a big Trivium fan. But, ha uh, so we just wanted to swing by. We wanted to check out your guitar. So if you could tell us about your guitars, that'd be wicked. Well, it's been out for, for a while now. Um, Actually, let's go over. Let's go over and see. Let's go over and see them, because they're, they're wicked anyway. These ones, these ones have been out for... I think this is the second NAM they've been out. Um, so they came out really cool. They play great. Um, and they're they're pretty much just like the, the USA models I have. Uh, they're just I, trying to, I can't think of the, the specs off the top of my head. It's been a while, <laughs> but I know they use like slightly different woods on certain things to, okay. to get the price point down. But like I can play them live with my other guitars and there's no tonal difference or playing like Sometimes I like playing these more. There's just like a certain feel to them that are great. So they're great playing guitar for, you know, the price you can get them at. And it's pretty much, you know, the same pickups, Floyd Rose, same configurations with all the, you know, the, the electronics and everything. So it's pretty much, you know, exactly what I play anyway. So, okay, uh, so is there, so what would be the main differences between say your custom shop model and something like this? Because the main thing is like, obviously when a kid watches you guys play and stuff like that and a guy's like oh man I really want one of Corey's guitars but obviously the custom shop level you're talking three four thousand dollars and stuff so what is the difference between say the custom shop model to something like your standard model here I know with these ones uh, like the neck and the body are uh, different woods um, but the Floyd's the same pickups are the exact same and then obviously the fact that the, the difference in the paint jobs and the fact that they're not uh, handmade, which you know the hours of someone b hand building it yeah, yeah. makes the price go up. So, but you know from the, you know, I guess the, from a factory to a custom shop, they've done an amazing job with replicating the feel and the sound. So you're still getting quite the bang for your buck. And uh, I played these things live myself with my uh, custom shops. And as I said, like, I haven't had to do anything to change my tone or adjust anything with my uh, my live rig. So. Yeah, it just shows you how well the guitars are. It's superb. So really, really quick one on the uh, one thing that I've always wanted to know as well is you guys switched to Kemper recently, right? So when you're playing live with your um, with your guitars, obviously you've got the same pickups in your custom shop models and these models. How does it, one thing that always takes me back is the vibe and the feel on stage. Does it, has it changed your vibe or feel on stage switching to something like a Kemper? No, we've been playing We've been playing on in-ears for so many years, and we use like really high-grade, high-quality in-ears that you know you crank them up. They got so many drivers in them; it sounds like you got like a monitor system strapped to your head. So if you turn them up, you still get the low end, and you can still feel it on the stage. So it just gives like you can really hear just like at least for the way we mix it with uh with our our sound guy and the way everyone in the band likes it. It pretty much like when we've showed other people. Like, hey, check out our, our live mixes. They're just like, well, it sounds like you're playing to a CD because we just balance everything like kind of like how you're mixing a record. Yeah. So it just makes it for like to keep the band tight and uh, just be able to like consistently play, really hear what you're playing and and really stay you know stay tight. Mm. And then uh, obviously, hopefully, not blow your ears out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly. Well. Thanks very much for just, you know, talking us through your guitars, my man. Um, obviously, Corey from Trivium, make sure you go... I mean, I didn't. I was about to say, make sure you go listen to Trivium. I don't even think that's a necessary thing to say anymore. I think it's just a, a metal staple in the whole of metal and industry. So. Well, we'll be over in Europe in March. Oh, okay, well, there Tour. you go. So let's go check them out in March. So thanks very much. Yeah, exactly. So, um, Josh Allen at the NAM, Winter NAM 2018 show. Cheers, guys.